A man is campaigning on the fact that he's going to raise your taxes. I haven't seen. His people won't let him frack, and Joe doesn't have any clue where he is. You know that. Where am I? Where am I? What state am I in? He's only got it wrong about seven times. Where am I? Is this Arizona or is this Nevada? Where am I? Tell me, where am I? If you vote for Biden, it means no kids in school, no graduations, no weddings, no Thanksgiving, no Christmas, and no Fourth of July together. Other than that, you have a wonderful life. Can't see anybody, but that's all right. You have a wonderful life. He wants everyone to, and it's not really, again, it's not him. I'm using this thing, he, it's, but it's not him. He did. <laughs> He's a puppet. He is a puppet. He's a puppet. He's a beauty, I'll tell you. Look, look, look. I shouldn't say this because it's very disrespectful, but I don't care. Because he's not a nice guy. We have some historians here, true American historians here. He is the worst candidate ever to run in the history of a, pres of a presidential election. He is the worst. That's why there's tremendous pressure on me. I wish he was a good candidate. At least if you lost, you could say, hey, you lost to a good candidate. How the hell do you lose to a guy like this?